What's up, people? TSA Chew Train So Hard University Prodigal Son back with another video. Before we get started, make sure you hit that like and subscribe. Ah, you saw the title, so let's go ahead and jump in this bitch head first. Short people, short people, short people. We have so many disadvantages in this world, and at times it can be very frustrating. But sometimes we have to think that there may be a person that has even more of a disadvantage in every aspect of life. This person would be Mr. Jason Owen. After doing a video about uh, Larry Will's six foot one frame would be too short to be successful in strongman, I thought, hell, let me find the, the shortest person that ever did it. So I came across him, looked at his, checked out some of his lifts on Instagram. Um, quite impressive, not even just for his size, just quite impressive period. But what I want to do now is read a little snippet from an article that was written about him. I'm not going to read the whole thing, but just basically so you can kind of get an idea of who this is. At just four, feet, four foot five inches tall, Jason Owen is... Owen is the UK's only dwarf bodybuilder, but that doesn't stop him from bench pressing more than twice his own body weight. The 30-year-old doorman, now this is back in 2012, the 30-year-old doorman who works in bars around Essex and Surrey tips the scale at 11 stone, but can bench press a whopping 26 stone. The same as an adult gorilla. Why they compare it to a dope gorilla out of everything that you can compare it to, I don't know. But I'm going to leave it at that. But what I want to do is talk about or ask a question. Is strong man biased towards short people? It's a rhetorical question. So you obviously know that it is. Because I did the last video on that subject. But if it's biased to short people, but they can still compete. It has to be even worse when it comes to dwarfs or midgets. PC, PC name, little people. But, but should dwarfs or little people that want to compete in strongman, should they be kept away from it just because of the lack of size that they were born with? Or should they, or should there be accommodation, <laughs> accommodations made? For instance, with the Atlas Stones, shit, knock the platforms down to half, you know, because at the end of the day, they still travel in the same distance to put it up. You know, even though you're tall and your platform will be bigger, you know, it'll be just as difficult for a little person or dwarf strong man to be able to put it on their highest platform when it comes to the Atlas Stones. Um, then the finger fingers. Hell, just give them many finger fingers. Fingles fingers. Give them small ones. You know, make it easier or make it more realistic for us small people or short people and the uh, and the actual quote unquote dwarfs. I know I just said a whole bunch of bullshit. Make sure you hit the like and subscribe button. Enjoy these clips of Mr. Jason Owen. And his oppressive lifts, pound for pound, strongest man in the world. Till next time, I'm out.
Hurt. Come on. Let's go. Come on. Come on, Jeremy. Let's go. Come on, man. Let's go. Get that shit. Let's go. Let's go. One more. Come on. You got this. One more. Let's go. You got time. Come on. Hell yeah. Let's go. Go, go, go. That's it. Now, ready? Crush it. Shoot your butt back and then all the way through on your toes. Go, 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 go. Look at that. God damn you, beat. <laughs> Woo! Oh my God, I told you. That was so much. Tacky high five. You're stuck to me forever. No, <laughs>